to Midtown West. Um, Miss Emily here once again um, to bring you a um, feeling foundation for the week. But before I do that, I just want to acknowledge that um, this week marks pretty much one year um, of COVID and of quarantine um, and of you spending a lot more time um, with your kids than maybe ever before. And um, I just wanna acknowledge that and celebrate that and celebrate the fact that you made it um, and that the Lord has upheld you and sustained you and um, brought you to today. So I'm praising God with you in that and also acknowledging um, the hard with you. Um, know that it's been hard, know that there are things that you have grieved um, individually and sacrificed individually and are grieving as a family. Um, and also, I know that the Lord has been um, faithful in holding you and upholding you and walking with you through this past year. And so, um, yeah, I just encourage you as we hit this year mark this week to um, go there with him and talk to him about it and celebrate and grieve and um, yeah, just acknowledge that it's been a year and it's been a hard one and it's been a good one. So um, yeah, and I hope that the Lord continues to encourage you in all the ways that you are um, yeah, just getting to spend time with and um, be parents to these wonderful kids and um, the ways that you get to see him, see the Lord and see um, his glory and his goodness revealed through him. And um, I'm praying that this email will again um, be a resource for you to um, draw closer to the Lord um, and walk alongside him as he draws his kids um, to himself and your kids to himself. So um, this week, the Family Foundation, um, which I feel like is so fitting in a, in a week of celebrating and acknowledging the year mark of COVID as well. Um, and the Family Foundation this week is set your mind where Christ is and on all that is good and true. And I was thinking about this and just thinking about um, how we are what we think about and we are um, where we look. And the Lord makes that clear so often in scripture. And um, the scripture that is quoted in this in this foundation is from Philippians. And it's talking about whatever is good and whatever is honorable, whatever is true, um, whatever, whatever is excellent, whatever is worthy um, of praise and just basically Paul is saying whatever um, is good and beautiful and true, like Jesus, um, is what um, we are to look at and um, set our minds on. And so I'm going to pray for the Lord to do that within each of you and to do that within each child. Um, and I just think of, especially in this day and age when there's so much to potentially fix our thoughts on and our minds on and so many, so many different avenues of information and um just things trying to grab our attention. I want to pray for the Lord to um, help us to keep our attention on him and for him to transform our minds um, as he helps us do that. So, Father God, I thank you. Um, thank you that you are good and beautiful and true. Um, Jesus, thank you that you've given us these minds um, to think on things that are good and beautiful and true. And I pray, Lord, that you would help us do that. I pray against the schemes of the enemy to distract us or to um, lull us to sleep in our minds or um, just take our thoughts away from you. Um, and Holy Spirit, I pray that you would help every parent and every child, um, every family at Midtown West, um, fix their eyes and their thoughts and their minds on you. And would you continue to transform them, transform their minds to, um, yeah, just be set on you and um, walk in that direction, follow you. Um, thank you that where we fix our mind and we fix our eyes is where we go. Um, and so, Lord, I just um, claim that 
we want to fix our eyes on you. We long to fix our eyes on you. We know we're made to fix our eyes on you um, and follow you. So do help us do that um, in this week ahead. I pray cultivate um, this within each family. And um, yeah, we just acknowledge and celebrate and praise you for this past year, um, all of the hard and all of the good, all the ways that you have upheld us all. Um, thank you, Lord. Bring to mind um, things that we can be praising you for um, that we can't think of right now. Um, would you bring it to mind? And um, help us to remember your goodness and your faithfulness. That is always true. Um, thank you that that is who you are. And we love you and we thank you and praise you for this day. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye, y'all. I'll see you next week.